Hi, it's Dan Hike here from Tremble Digital and uh, what we're going to be looking at is how to uh, roll back changes that we might have made to a page using the revisions functionality that you find in the edit post screen. Alright, so um, here we have a page and uh, if we go and have a look at it in the back end um, you'll see that it looks like a little bit of a mess. Um, if we click the back end editor here uh, you can see that the content is missing and uh, the computer's just lost the plot a little bit and uh, that's what happens sometimes, technology fails us. Um, not to worry though, we do remember that uh, it worked a while ago uh, before we made some changes, it was all good. So all we have to do is um, we come down here to our revision section. Now if you don't see the revision section uh, that might be because it's uh, not selected to be shown. You need to click this button here in the top right hand corner that says screen options and uh, you'll see a tick box here that says revisions and uh, depending on whether that's selected or not you're going to see the revision section down at the bottom I'll just wait for the computer to finish doing what it's doing okay so there's the tick box there for revisions and if I select that then we'll see the revisions section so we go right down to the bottom and uh, we can see that it's gone a little bit haywire over the last few saves that we've made um, it was definitely working four weeks ago so all we need to do is just uh, click on this date here and what it's going to do is it's going to roll the page back to when those 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 to before the latest changes have been made. So it just goes through it a little bit. Uh, you're not going to be able to read any of this. It's all it's very very heavily laden with program code. So just uh, accept what it says as gospel. All you need to do is click this button here that says restore this revision. And uh, what it's going to do next is it's going to um, change the page back to its last working form. Alright, so it's going to update in just a second and then we're going to be able to see how it looks. Alright, so if we click in backend editor now, alright, so we can see that it's working properly now. Our content is here. So what we have to do now is we click update and we wait for that to update, of course. And if we click refresh on this page now, it looks like it's working at this point, but. Um, all right, so everything's good now, and we can uh, go off onto other jobs happily. All right, if you have any questions, just hit me up here at Bloom360, and otherwise, have fun. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.